Hello everyone and welcome back to Bitcoin Tips. So today we are going to be talking about how you can start mining a new popular meme coin called Dog With Hat. And if that all sounds interesting to you, I do want to make sure to ask you to stick around through the entire video as there's a ton of different tips and tricks that you can use with this program to help you earn more cryptocurrency in less time. So before we dive into the video, I always like to start off here on CoinMarketCap, just taking a look at what's going on in cryptocurrency at the time of recording, in case you are watching this video in the future. So feel free to skip ahead one to two minutes if you aren't interested in this part of the video. So as you can see, it's been a relatively flat day here across the board in cryptocurrency, overall up about 0.1%, but with the day chart, it's looking like you know at least the top four cryptos here are down just a tiny little bit. So overall, no major change from yesterday, but still looking good with prices higher than we've seen in a while. So the coin that we are talking about today is WIF coin or dog with hat. This is currently worth about $3.29, putting it at number 42 on coin market cap. So very, very cool. This is being compared to other coins like Bonk, Shiba Inu, uh, Book of Meme, and others. So this could be a very good coin to hold as we get closer to the Bitcoin halving and next bull run. This is a contract on Solana. So you do have to have a Solana address, which we will talk about here in just a minute. But let's dive into how you can start mining this coin in less than 10 minutes. So we will be using a site called Unminable, which allows you to mine coins that are not traditionally mineable coins. So once you get here to the site, which the link is down below if you're interested in checking it out, you can see there's a ton of different algorithms. Now the tutorial today will be based on GPU mining and I'm going to be basing it on the Kapow algorithm. Now with that being said, if you're not familiar with what is the best algorithm for your specific computer, I would recommend checking out the site what to mine. It allows you to enter in your specific hardware and tells you the best algorithm to choose. So once you know a little bit more about your algorithm or if you want to follow along with Kapow, what you're going to want to do is select get started with our wizard. Here you'll see there's basic and advanced. I'm going to be using the basic option advanced. It allows you to set your region, your ports, your worker names, things like that. But the basic option is good for 99% of people. So again, I'm going with uh, GPU. If you are mining with a CPU, all that's going to do is give you a different selection of algorithms. So feel free to go that way if you know what you want to do with CPU. Like I said, I'm going to be choosing Kapow, but here's where you would choose if you're going with a different algorithm. We're mining the dog with hat and again, the wallet address. Now I will take a brief second to pause here and say, please, please, please double check your address. If you enter in the incorrect address, the miner will still work. The only thing is when it comes time to get paid out, you will not be able to get paid. And even if you realize before requesting a payout, the coins you mine are bound to this address. So you wouldn't actually be able to earn them. You can always come back in here and create a new file, generate a new account worker with the correct address, but anything you mine to the incorrect one will not be able to be paid out. And if you don't have an address on the Solana network, they do give you a couple great options here. Trust wallet's really good. Um, so I would recommend checking that out to get your address. So once you've double checked everything here, you can proceed to the next step, which is the referral code. Now I do like to mention here, the referral program here on the unminable site is a little different than what we've seen in other places. My referral code is Bitcoin dash tips, uh, capital B capital T. I recommend that you use it as it does help out the channel and it actually helps you out as well. The regular pool fee here on unminable is 1%. So if you mine 100 dog with hat coins, you are only going to be earning 99. One of those coins is going to unminable, regardless if you mine it in one day, one week, one year, it doesn't matter if the coin is $3 or $300, one coin is always going to them. Now, with that being said, if you use my referral code, your 
pool fee is actually discounted to 0.75%. So you are saving 25% on that pool fee. So very, very cool. It helps out the channel. It helps you out. Um, so feel free to enter that in here. It's also down below in the description. And if you're not interested in that, you can go ahead and say continue without referral code, but you will pay that higher fee. So once you do that, you can go ahead and say next, and you are officially at the last step for this process. This is when you would choose your mining program and download the file. The only call out I will give here is make sure you're choosing a miner that's compatible with your hardware. Things like NB Miner and G Miner, they are both great options. Uh, they work with both NVIDIA and AMD GPUs, whereas Team Red and T Rex works with AMD and NVIDIA, respectively. So, with that in mind, uh, I usually go with G Miner. It works really well for me. Um, but once you choose your miner, what you're going to do is go to Download Miner Files. This will redirect you to the GitHub page where you just have to select the Windows 64.zip. This will download the program. And one thing I do want to mention is you will most likely get a call out here in your Google Chrome, Microsoft Edge, uh, you know, Firefox, any of the other browsers will most likely call this file out as unverified or dangerous file. You are going to have to let this through and say download file anyways. If you're not comfortable with doing that, then simply don't download it. Um, but unfortunately, there is no workaround. When it comes to GPU mining, CPU mining, and crypto mining in general, these files are often flagged by antivirus programs. And I can personally confirm that the files here are safe. I've used them on my personal computer as well as GPU mining rigs for many years. But that does not mean they are always 100% safe and will be for all of time. So if you're not comfortable doing that, then don't. Uh, but once you download those files, you will have to extract them. That is very important. This will not work if you don't extract them. And then you'll go ahead and download the .bat file, which again, you'll get that same call out. You will have to let it through. Once you download that, make sure you just drag and drop it into the same folder. So as you can see here, there's a ton of other random files in here. Um, but as you can see, I have unminable dash wif dash kapow dash g minor at this point all you have to do is go ahead and double click this file now again you can see here you get this windows defender we protected your pc you will get this just the first time you run it uh, but you will have to go ahead and say more info and run anyway again if you're not comfortable with doing this then don't uh, but there is no other way to get this to run without doing the run anyway so just like that, here we are about 7 minutes and 47 seconds into the video, and that was including, you know, a little bit of an intro and coin market cap. We are up and mining dog with hat. So very, very cool. It is extremely simple, and at this point, you can turn off your monitors. The computer itself needs to stay on, but you can basically get up, go about your day, and your computer will be passively earning you this awesome cryptocurrency. So... Just a few other things I want to call out about mining. Make sure you have proper cooling on your computer. Your GPU or CPU, if you go that route, is going to run much hotter than normal, and it will most likely be at 100%. So when it does come time to close out your miner to stop mining, all you have to do is hit X here on the CMD window. Um, but before I close this out, one thing I do want to say is when you start mining, it takes about 10 to 15 minutes for the stats to show up here on Unminable. So when you go up under your address, it is going to take a little while for information to show up. That's completely normal. As long as you're not getting any major red text here in the CMD window, everything is working okay. And on the other side, when it is time to go ahead and close this out, as long as the CMD window is gone, you can see it's not minimized, it is completely closed, you will no longer be mining. With that being said, you will still see stats and additional income even here on the website. That is completely normal. It's a little strange and it can, you know, th make you think that hey, you know, maybe I am still mining coins when you want to be, you know, using the computer or going, you know, shutting it down to go to sleep or whatever you might be doing. That's completely normal. So, uh, don't worry too much. It does take up to an hour as long as I've seen um, you know, it still report a miner active. 
So with that being said, again, the link to Unminable, as well as my referral code, which again, is just Bitcoin-Tips, capital B, capital T, is down below. It does help you out uh, in saving 25% on your pool fee, lowering it down to 0.75. So again, thank you so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. And if you do run into any issues with setting this program up, please make sure to leave a comment. Always happy to try and help troubleshoot and get your miner up and running. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you in my next video.